this doesn't deserve an intro. This doesn't deserve a lot of things, but we're talking about it today. I know the views have been low. I know they've been low, and you know, God, I can't control it sometimes. I can't curse right now because this is the beginning of a YouTube video. But today, we're here to talk about Dragon Ball Super Marga Chapter 65. If y'all like rants, this is the video, okay? Now listen, I have put up with Toritaro shit for the past like couple months, man. I've been giving them breaks. I'm like, you know what? I kind of like this arc. Even though I've criticized the hell at a Terminal Power arc, the Future Truck Saga. You can't really criticize the Universe 6 Saga because it's so short and Resurrection we have to even happen in the manga and Battle of Gods, and I was just like, just Battle of Gods the movie, but light. This is insane, man. Okay, listen, no matter how many times I turn my brain off just for cool stuff, right? Because I love Master Ultra Instinct, okay? I love the form. Again, I'm a Goku fan, but the amount of character regression that he's done that I've just, I kept on turning a blind eye to because he's made Piccolo sound like the dumbest character in Dragon Ball history so far. I've made jokes at Vegeta. Vegeta literally lost the same way he lost in Resurrection F and they kept on talking about how, look at this character development that's, that we already saw in the Boo Saga and now they have Goku. Now listen, I made a video talking about how Goku's a hero. Please check it out. And I, and I did a review over the last chapter saying like, hey, listen, if Goku messes up, that's fine. As long as it's not like ridiculous, right? Like if he's trying to like, you know, show forgiveness, fine. But as long as it's not ridiculous, Toratolo has made a meme out of Goku's decision, bro. It feels like Team Four Star has, has made this manga chapter, bro. Again, I love Team Four Star, but literally Torotaro can't make a freaking chapter without referencing something from the past, man. Like, literally, like, this is just another reference, bro. Like, it'd be, it'd be okay, it'd be one thing, like, for example, if he let his guard down, or he, he did something in the terms of, like, he tried to heal, like, Moro, some different type of way. This man literally, literally in the Cell Saga, he took the sense of being from Krillin and gave it the perfect cell. Literally, Moro looks damn near like perfect cell, <laughs> and he took the sense of being from Krillin. Why, man? Like, here's the thing, man. Maybe in with context of a full chapter, this might make sense, okay? Maybe. But God damn it, this makes sense right now! It doesn't! I'm tired of this man writing Dragon Ball, okay? If you see my rants, I'm not a shield for Torotaro. I give that man shit when he deserves it. And this is one of those chapters, man. Why does he keep doing this? He writes characters in memes. Not in storytelling, not a progression, in memes. Look, I make fun of Vegeta all the time, but even I can admit that that Vegeta shit was just a meme, bro. I'm just like, oh yeah, you see how he lost a, a, to Frieza in the Resurrection F with a big bank attack? Let's just do that again. Oh, remember when Goku threw the sense of being towards Cell in the Cell Saga? Let's do that again. <laughs> Remember when Goku did that little flex thing when he got mad at Freeze when he turned Super Saiyan? Let's do that again, but let him do Ultra Instinct now. Like, listen, I love what he's done with Ultra Instinct Goku fighting more in the last chapter. And, and there might be some cool fights in this chapter, but bro, it's a lot of padding that's going on. And I think Torotaro's gonna do classic Torotaro, where he starts an arc really great, has some great concepts, then he starts doing some random character uh, regression, then he just Fs up the final arc, right? Look. I want to give this man a break, man. I made too many rants back in the Terminal Power R just talk about how dumb the writing was and how much he rushed everything. But I refuse to let this slide, man, okay? I am a Goku fan, not a fanboy. He's just my favorite character of all time. And the fact of the matter is, is that he keeps making these characters memes of themselves. Like, bro, Vegeta is like, oh my God, look how great of a character he is. He's so like good now. It's been that way since the Boo Saga. Piccolo, Piccolo can't figure out shit. He's so dumb. <laughs> Uh, like the only character he's writing somewhat maybe decently is Gohan, but even uh, in Gohan in the, in the Terminal Power, they just got rid of Ultimate Form. Like you literally had Ultimate Form in the Battle of Gods with the Bang, now you just have Gohan without no Bang now. And with Goku, literally it's just like, it's no, it's no progression, it's just that he's relearning the same lessons all over again. Like, Goku knew to take out Goku Black in the Goku Black Saga. Like, he knew to take out Frieza in Resurrection F. Like, Goku has a balance of forgiveness and taking out an enemy that he needs to. I'm gonna give Tortar a break if he has some type of dumb thing, like where Goku's like, okay, listen, I'm gonna do this or that, and maybe, fine. But no, you just say, fuck it, let's just do another reference, baby! Remember the Cell Saga? Like, look, man. 
I'm trying to give this nigga a break. <laughs> like, I wish y'all could see my face right now because I'm livid. But a man looks like a hobo right now. I got to wait till my next haircut. But man, listen, I'm not trying to hate on this dude. I'm really not. If you see my last chapters, man, I've been giving 10 out of 10s, 9 out of 10s. You know, I'll probably blow out this microphone at this point yelling so loud. But I'm telling you this. If he does this, like, look, and you know, my boy Kendall, who's a Vegeta fan. Oh, you're only mad because Goku getting messed over. Look, man, Vegeta, it was one of those things where, like, you can even make some BS reason. Like, okay, well, his mistake in Resurrection F, it got rewards because of Whis, so he didn't really learn his lesson. You could make some BS reason like that. Or, but this is like, Goku learned when he did that against Cell that it was a bad decision. Because Gohan, like, was put in a situation where he wasn't ready for it. Like, listen, I know Goku looks very confident. He's probably going to dodge Moro's next attack, but no! Like, why are we just keep throwing references over and over again to previous arcs and no character progression? It's just a character assassination. Like, listen, I have defended Dragon Ball Super Goku so many times, bro, especially the anime version. I'm not defending this, okay? If you got slander, nigga, then throw that slander out because it deserves it, okay? I usually just talk about people being really negative towards Dragon Ball Super Mong and talk about how, like, you know, it's not deserved. Nah, this is universal. <laughs> Destroy this. <laughs> okay, but seriously, though, if the chapter comes out and is, like, you know, somewhat decent, fine. But if, from what I'm seeing right now, I don't care how cool the fighting is, and I'm probably going to be hyped about it. This is stupid. This is stupid. As a Goku fan, I don't like it. I'm not trashing all the drama on Super Goku or whatever, because, you know, some people, they love to jump out the wagon. But nah, man. This is stupid. I don't like it. And if you're a person that hasn't been checking my previous videos, become an X-Fighter. Subscribe to the channel. <laughs> You might get some rants like this. You might get some power scaling videos. You might get some reviews. You might get a bunch of stuff, man. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Become an X-Fighter. Uh, check out my review of My Academia, Manga Chapter, whatever I did yesterday. And I did a Top Strong as God of High School, man. Just check out, support the channel. My, I've been dying out here. Need a support. <laughs> but yeah, man. Uh, yeah, I didn't like this. I didn't like this a lot. Uh, I probably didn't put any much editing. Y'all could just feel my anger. Like, this is so freaking stupid. Torotaro needs to go. And if it's a Kiritorama saying, like, hey, let's just throw another Sensu Bean reference. Come on. Like, the cell. Get rid of this nigga, too, bro. Like, I can't do this. I can't do this right now, bro. Like, you just keep making characters become memes, bro. Like, I love Team Four Star. I met all these people in person. But this is starting to feel like a Team Four Star skit, bro. This is really starting to feel like it. And I don't like it, bro. And, like, again, if you've been a part of the channel, I'm the defender of Dragon Ball Super. This is stupid. I don't like it. <laughs> so, anyway, man. Um, X Fighters, man, you know, continue to support the channel, man. Show me some love, man. We're almost at 20k. And when we get to 20k, I'm gonna upload, I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna start my Discord. We can talk, um, play some Among Us if I have the time. You know, let's just do some stuff together. And I want, you know, bond with y'all a little bit more, man. So, yeah, son to job, peace. Love you, Toro Taro. Stop, get off the weed. <laughs>